As a society, we have skyrocketed out of the Industrial Revolution straight into the Computer Revolution, and it has thoroughly embraced us. Computers are found in just about every aspect of modern life, enabling key technologies in such areas as education, business, industry, and communications. And as our dependence grows, we demand that our electronic devices become smaller, faster, smarter, and cheaper. Semiconductor chips provide the backbone for modern computing systems. They are complex microelectronic circuits composed of a base material with electrical conductivity greater than an insulator, but less than a conductor. The typical base material is silicon, although germanium is also used. The first microprocessor, the Intel 4004, introduced in 1971, contains 2,300 transistors. Today's processors have hundreds of millions. Chemical engineers are deeply involved in developing specialized materials and complex chip manufacturing processes. Their constant quest is for progressively smaller semiconductor chips and computer components that provide ever-increasing speed, greater memory, and broader functionality. Clever chemistry is what lets you put thousands of songs and photos on your hard drive without having to add another room to your house. But the chemistry gets tricky, especially when we shrink magnets to cram more and hence more data onto disks. For the last decade or so, the magnetic coating most often used on hard drives has been a metal alloy of cobalt, chromium, and platinum. The first two make up 50 to 60 percent of the mixture and provide the magnetism while the platinum keeps the coatings magnetic regions from flipping directions too easily. A common type of display technology used in computer monitors is liquid crystal displays or LCDs. The liquid crystals that make up the displays are substances that have both the structure of a liquid and a solid. This physical duality gives liquid crystals special optical properties. By choosing the appropriate molecules, an LCD display can be created using the very precise alignment of the molecules that are obtained when applying an electric current. This enables the production of images on a flat surface by the passage of light through the liquid crystals and color filters. Organic light emitting diodes or OLED displays have been emerging as competitors for LCD displays from some time and are now common in mobile phones. OLED is a display device that sandwiches carbon based films between the two electrodes and when voltage is applied it creates light. The dynamic interplay of chemistry with device physics results in these remarkable displays. In the last two decades, advances in computer technology from processing speed to network capacity and the internet have revolutionized the way scientists work. From se sequencing genomes to monitoring the Earth's climate, many recent scientific advances would not have been possible without a parallel increase in computing power. And with revolutionary technology such as the quantum computing edging towards reality, the relationship between computing and science will continue to bring us new discoveries.